Hey guys, Logan with Enduro Engineering here going to give you a closer look at our new mountain bike stand that we offer for mountain bikes as well as the e-mountain bikes. So the Enduro Engineering mountain bike stand is pretty universal. It almost fits all makes and models from e-bikes to standard mountain bikes. Here we have this Husky e-bike on it. All other e-bikes will fit as well. There's a lot of adjustability to it. So we'll show you how this e-bike fits as well as the standard mountain bike. With just a little bit of an adjustment, we're able to go from the e-bike to a standard mountain bike, just like that. Okay, so we'll show you once you unbox your mountain bike stand here, we'll show you how to assemble it as well as all the adjustments that it has. So first step in assembling is you're gonna put on the crossbar for the stabilization for it. So you're just gonna take this, line the threaded hole up with a hole at the bottom of the main part of the stand. And then you're gonna take the provided button head bolt and thread it through the stand and into the crossbar. Once you get that button head bolt started, this is where you're gonna take a four millimeter Allen wrench and just go ahead and tighten that bolt down. Next step is gonna be putting on the wheel stay. So you're gonna take out the top button head bolts here along with the spacers. So just pull, pull both of these bolts out and then we'll line up the wheel stay. Okay, you're gonna take the wheel stay from your kit here, take the same bolts that you just removed. You're gonna have that spacer. The spacer is gonna go between the main part of the stand and the wheel stay. And then take the bolt with the washer and thread it through. And then just get it started by hand. We're not gonna tighten these yet. Okay, we left this wheel stay loose, that way we can adjust it up and down. Depending on the wheel size you use, whether you use a 29, 27 and a half, whatever wheel size you're using, you can adjust this to fit that wheel. There's also adjustments throughout the stand. You've got the thumb screw here to adjust the pad. That way we can cradle the bike in the right position, as well as we can lift this pad up and down using the thumb knob down here to adjust it along the tracks to lift or lower the pad. Okay, once you have your bike stand adjusted for the pad for the bike to sit on, this is where you're gonna take your bike and then you're gonna put it on top of the stand. Again, we've got the wheel stay loose at this point. So you're gonna line it up and then you're gonna see right where that wheel stay needs to be. Once you have your bike on it, now you can take a five millimeter Allen wrench and go ahead and you tighten both these bolts on the wheel stay on both sides. That way it's gonna be in the right spot for that bike. If you go and switch bikes, that's when you can loosen it up and adjust the wheel stay as well as the pads if you're switching from bike to bike. Okay, once you wrap the rubber strap around your front wheel here and really lock it in, now we're locked right under the stand. It's gonna allow you to do some of the key features that this bike allows. You can lube your chain, you can adjust your derailleur, you can bleed your brakes, you can do any kind of component changes and even wash the bike. You can power wash it and not have to worry about it tipping over. A lot of key features here. It's unique to the Enduro Engineering mountain bike stand. If you're sick of your expensive investments in your e-bikes and mountain bikes just sitting on the ground or leaned against the wall in their garage ready to scratch something, get yourself an Enduro Engineering bike stand Get those bikes off the ground and keep them fresh for your next ride.